In the last few minutes, Common Councilors in Plattsburgh just concluded a public hearing where they tabled a plan to revitalize the city's waterfront. NBC5's Benny Nazai tells us what the plan and changes could mean for the Lake City. I think the lake is one of the best things for the city of Plattsburgh and the least developed. Steve Brody has been a longtime downtown business owner in Plattsburgh and says the waterfront is key to the city's success. It all unites the city together as a thread that bring us all together as one big unit and utilizing the city riverfront and lake frontage is major. The purpose of the local waterfront revitalization program is to outline a vision for the city's waterfront that would pave the way to create new projects in hopes of establishing easier access to the waterfront and promote new recreational opportunities. Creating easier public access to the city's waterways, marinas and boat launches has been a top priority for Plattsburgh leaders. There's um, 27 pre-vetted products that are included in this plan. And so it allows a lot of those projects to begin moving forward and be eligible for funding. With the desire to also bring back tourism to the Lake City, resident John Glorioso says bringing folks from all over is much needed. We had an ample amount of Canadian tours come down to Plattsburgh, as well as out-of-staters. I mean, I think it's vital and crucial for the economic uh, development of the downtown area. But residents still believe the city is heading in the right direction to address this issue. I think we're going in a positive direction for sure, and I think that uh, this town would, would benefit from this direction we're going in. A timeline for the development hasn't been released. In Plattsburgh, Benny Nazai, NBC5 News.